what's going on everybody uh today's video we're gonna be talking about a new counter blocks update that just came out so if you guys don't know scapter one of the main devs for counter blocks he recently made an announcement talking about all the new updates this is what it said in the announcement uh partial ui overhaul community market which is brand new i'll show that in the video uh economy reset for banking which is kind of weird but i do remember there was uh, some people that had a lot of banking bucks saved up so this is kind of interesting to see them reset that all all like all of a sudden out of nowhere new map areas several trading system rewrites uh new event the event was pretty cool except for the fact that literally like probably 10 people got it but that's besides the point um only one server can complete the event all servers can participate but the first to finish the event is the only one that earns a reward you must participate to earn the reward at the end there is a lockout for participating so if you do not like help you're not getting anything steps will take a while to complete yet it got done in like less than an hour so that's whatever um they re they increased the player count from 28 to 38 for the event but i'll definitely be showing that in the video if you guys want to check the rest of this out it's going to be kind of a short video but still definitely worth talking about uh, they also mentioned they fixed the fps which is kind of hard to believe i swear every time i play this game i always get like fps drops or whatever and they also fixed some of the skins not showing up in game so like i know there's a <laughs> like it's, it's about time they kind of like step in and fix all these like skins that people spend money to earn and it's like stock skins in game so hopefully all that got handled out the way and uh, let's kind of get into the gameplay so when i first got on the server here i noticed there was like a massive pillar that everybody was just like crowding around and uh, a lot of people were just blocking the button one of the main things you do is just click on it to move it forward and uh, we actually got it all the way down to the end and there's like a funny clip. I think someone just died right when it got to that, which is kind of funny. So after you get that there, uh, you're gonna notice everything's pretty much set on fire. I think this is the part where you just need to find all like the, the wheels around the map and just click on them. Uh, there's gonna be a bunch of wheels put around the map here. So just make sure you look all around the area and make sure you click on each one of them. And uh, you'll notice that teddy bear on the left, that's gonna come into another step later. So just remember the teddy bear. After you click on this last wheel, you'll notice the place starts flooding. And then from here on out, I believe the next step is you have to find all the teddy bears. So after this, uh, I'll be honest with y'all, we did not make it very far. Uh, the, the event was already over. There's probably going to be a lot of information that I missed out on up to this point. So if there's anything, please leave a comment down below with all the steps because this is my first server I joined. I might have missed something in the beginning. But I do remember there is a part where after you turn the water on, there's like this secret room under that you can push yourself down. And there's going to be like a campfire. And I got to this point and I think what was supposed to happen is uh, all around the map in every single parkour area, there's, there's going to be teddy bears like the one I mentioned previously. And once you collect every teddy bear, I think how it worked was that once you every teddy bear, you can click on the campfire and it'll give you the bayonet zero. So I don't know if that's true or not. I, if it is, please let me know in the comments down below, but I believe that's how it was done. Now, uh, before uh, we end off the whole event part, I do want to talk about the new marketplace. Yeah, uh, I kind of I kind of have no words to say. Uh, Among Us, great game. But uh, how, how the marketplace works is that it completely runs off banky bucks. What you do is you uh, find the item in your inventory. You come up with the price of how much you want to sell it for banky bucks wise, and then if somebody has enough banky bucks, you trade it off. But why would anybody accept the banky bucks as a currency? It just is like uh, it seems very unfitting throwing banky bucks for values because I don't know if that's actually gonna mess with the prices of everything. But it's it's quite interesting to see this. I can maybe see it still working in the future, but I would never never see somebody putting up like a really big rare or anything and selling it for banky bucks uh let me know what you guys think about this update uh leave a comment down below like the video please click subscribe if you have not already we're trying to hit 100,000 before the year ends so if you have not please 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 click subscribe i know for some people it even unsubscribed because youtube is weird so please double check that you're subscribed uh make sure to do your homework i should be done with school soon thank you all so much for supporting me i'm probably going to get back into streaming soon kind of big announcement getting off topic but i do appreciate y'all still sticking with me throughout school throughout college so thank you all so much make sure to do your homework have a blessed day